Alright guys, so let's just say it just updated, and a lot of things are actually new. A lot of new things actually just happened, so I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna be going over them. Hold on. So I'm gonna be going over the update stuff, so, well, I just showed you guys, we have the new gun here. It's called the G36. Um, I told you it's coming out in my leaks video, so it actually happened, which is sick. And you get it from one of the new crates that just came out called the Frostbite crate. It's like the Celtic crate. It's 20 days, though. The Celtic was 11. But it has the permanent, um, never, the new perm item, uh, the G36, and then a bunch of new building stuff. And then this holiday crate also came out. And it has a bunch of rare stuff inside of it. But you may notice there's no way to actually buy them or anything. So how do you get them? You, so there's a big tree in the center of the town here. And under the tree, a present spawns every 20 minutes, and it'll give you a present, and then it'll just, hit, and then you can open it right here, with the present that it gives you. So that's how you open those crates. And scavenge crates are actually taken out until after the update. So I'm assuming 20 days will be the update when it gets taken out. So scavenge crates are no longer a thing. And they updated the building tabs, so you can now resize things as well. So as you can see, I have this huge scavenge station. I can make it bigger if I wanted to. But I have that huge. They might take this out, though, because it's probably going to lead to a bunch of glitches and stuff. But I resized a bunch of stuff just in case they did. And then the map is now full of snow, obviously, on the rooftops and everything. It's a really nice, really nice addition to the update. I like it a lot. Now, let's take a further look at the uh, G36 here. So it does have a laser, which is pretty sick. That's really cool. It's red, and it does actually work if you point it at something. But it has a limit, just like the pistols do, for like um the the what's it called the USB. How it has like that flashlight, but it has a limit. That's what the laser is, and it's got a really nice fire rate. It's really smooth. It holds 26 bullets, just like the FAMAS. And then here I'm gonna test it out on my friend right here. It's really fast and very effective, as you can see. And that's basically it for the G36. It's really nice gun overall, pretty solid. And then the new snow fist is actually inside the holiday crate. And it throws snowballs. But the snowballs don't do any damage unless the other person has a snowball equipped. Unfortunately, I don't have this item, so I can't really show you guys. But if you do swing it like a fist, it will do damage. So it's basically an energy axe copy. But the snowballs don't do damage unless the other person has is wearing one. So that's it for that. And then another good thing to know about the Christmas tree is the presents are client-sided. So you do not have to worry about people camping here and taking all the presents from you. That's actually not possible. Because like, each person gets a present at a different time and only for their screen. So you don't got to worry about other people stealing, stealing your presents. It's always going to be there every 20 minutes. And the next one I'm going to show you guys this new prefab that we have here. Going inside, it looks like a barn. Really nice, like, you have a little cool security thing here. I think if you add, like, a post here, you could shoot, and then this could be a really good, like, base for defense right here, or even up here, and then you could have a door here and stuff. But that, that could be really cool. But for the most part, it's pretty much just a big barn. Nothing too special. And then next we have the Cabin Winter, which is more of like a big western type house. I really, I really like it. Rowlock actually leaked this to me in the leaks video that I made. So you have your garage here, and then going inside, it's really big and open. You can make a second level, a second floor area, and then up here, you actually have a balcony as well. So, for the second floor. And that's pretty much it. It's just a huge house that you can do whatever you want. We'll get some of the new um, items.